Talk TV's Mike Graham spoke to royal biographer Angela Levin about pictures showing Meghan Markle placing flowers at a memorial site for the 19 young students and two teachers who were murdered by a gunman on Tuesday in Uvalde, Texas. Meghan was photographed paying her respects to the victims, which has sparked a backlash from those who believe the 40-year-old was attempting to steal attention away from the tragedy. Mike commented. If she wanted to make a statement about what had happened she could have quite easily made a charitable donation. She could have sent a bunch of flowers instead of bringing them personally to put down there. She could have done it any number of different ways. But being photographed doing it clearly shows that Shush is doing it for publicity. She said she wanted to go incognito with, I think, a cap, Angel replied. And she went to a place very close by so she put her mask on but she was surrounded by people there. And people aren't daft, they could see she was there. But to send it to the media, that's the key isnt it. The journalist continued. She could have gone there. She could have had a photographer who wanted to take a picture for herself, because it was meaningful. But actually to then release it, it becomes all about her, as usual. That is the thing, isnt it. Mike agreed before Angela continued her rant against Meghan. I thought it was. For somebody who talks a lot about compassion, I thought it was just terrible, she remarked. And I've heard today that the parents are shocked by what Shush has done, taking photographs of her with their children, looking a wreck. Calling out Meghan's appearance, she went on. I mean I don't think you need to go looking dolled up. But actually, to go along with jeans and a white t shirt, it doesn't look very sophisticated. When she went around the memorial ground for soldiers a couple of years ago, she dressed decently. But this time, I don't know what's in her head that she can't actually take anything beyond herself. No, Mike added. Well, I think I would have had more sympathy, Angela, if it was somewhere nearby where she lived. Clearly, if it happened in her community, that's a very different thing. But Shush has had to get on a flight. Shush has had to get in a car. Shush has had to fly there. Had to get another car. Shush has had to get out of the car. Shush has had to make sure that the people were taking her picture. Shush has had to buy the flowers. I mean, Shush has gone to quite a lot of trouble to prove that Shush is full of compassion. Yes, 1,400 miles she had to fly, a very, very long journey, Angela chimed. And also the other thing is a grieving mother trying to understand other people's grief, which she obviously can't seem to do, is to take a whole load of bodyguards. That's also very strange.